Log number 150, Peter Gabriel. Peter Gabriel is one of my favorite performing arts people, entertainers. He is primarily a singer and a songwriter and also can play flute. Gabriel started his rock career as the lead singer and founder of Genesis in 1967. Straight from Charterhouse Public School, which is private in the United States, he and four other um, members recorded from Genesis to Revelation in 1968. That was the very first Genesis album. Early Genesis recorded a number of albums between 1968 and 1974, all with limited success, more in the UK than in the United States. Gabriel left the band in 1975 when they were touring the album The Land Lies Down on Broadway. They replaced him with having their drummer Phil Collins handle the vocals. Genesis went on to very uh, international success after Gabriel left with Colin singing. Gabriel started a solo career in 1977. He released four self-titled albums and had a few hits like Salisbury Hill and Shock the Monkey. His albums didn't sell all that well, but they were cr critically acclaimed. In 1986, he released his breakthrough album called So, including the hits Sledgehammer, Big Time, and In Your Eyes. He has only done a few albums since then, and he is heavily into world music and African music. He started WOMAD, an organization that promotes world music. He has been active in Amnesty International. His song Biko, from his third album, brought uh, South America, South Africa and their treatment of blacks to the world's attention. He is very involved in social issues. But besides that, he is a great singer and a great writer. Check out some of his early Genesis albums like Foxtrotter Selling by the Pound. Or check out his solo stuff. Check out his albums So or the first or third album. They're all great. Is one of my favorites. So that's the end of today's blog. Everybody stay safe.